I'd like to wish everybody here, all of our fans and supporters and friends out there who we don't have an opportunity to see at this time of the year, a uh, very happy holiday season. I know Nick Saban wants to find another championship hat underneath his Christmas tree tomorrow morning, but you know, shopping winding down here, some time for some last minute gifts. So even we got some last minute gifts for some of the teams and coaches that we cover. So we'll start with this one. It says UAB Blazer Nation. What does Blazer Nation get? A remote. And it says fast forward to September 2nd, 2017. That's the official date of UAB's first game back. It's been over two years since we've seen the Blazers on the football field. Bill Clark has worked tirelessly resurrecting this program from the dead. They got the players. They're getting the practice field renovated in that new pavilion. They're going to have a stadium in a couple years. It's time for some football for the UAB Blazers. How about this one? To Nick Saban, what do you get a guy who literally has everything? I mean, he's hoping he gets a couple more championship rings this year, but how about 10 more years as being a head coach at Alabama? Now, he is the fourth oldest head coach in the FBS. He's looking at 65. The retirement age is coming up. It might not be next year, the year after that, or the year after that, but there is a day coming soon where Nick Saban will no longer be a head coach, and he will be off enjoying his lake house. So. Give him 10 more years. Let's see what he can do with another decade at Alabama. How about Gus Malzahn? He could use a lot of things, but the biggest thing he could use, Jarrett Stidham. He's got him, but how about a quarterback who lives up to the hype? This is not the first year that Auburn's had a newcomer with a lot of excitement around him. Jeremy Johnson, John Franklin III, neither of those guys have lived up to it. Jarrett Stidham, we've seen a little bit of him. He's looked good. But he, if he can live up to the hype, maybe Auburn is knocking on the college football playoff next year. How about a couple stocking stuffers we have here? A pair of scissors to Samford. Well, their men's basketball team and football team are starting to win. So Scott Padgett and Chris Hatcher, the more they win, the more hot commodities they're going to be in the coaching world. So cut the phone lines, keep them around for a few more years at Samford. And one more for Lane Kiffin. A pair of sunglasses. That spotlight's going to be bright on him at FAU. And if he doesn't uh, win with the Owls, he might not get another head coaching job. So Kiffin used the sunglasses to block out the spotlight and just coach football. That's